G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Jean Woodle, and welcome back to what used to be a Majestic Crypt, but welcome back to 7 Days in Demolisher Only, where I am just taking cover for the moment, I'm trying not to be found, I'm like a mouse in a hole, desperate for nothing to hear me, the demo's super bloody explosive, more explosive than ever before, and they are rinsing the world every time I misplace a shot, so the risk is high, which means I'm hoping the reward is high, but that's what I'm hoping to get today. Overnight, I literally didn't leave this hole at all. I just cleared out of some of the rubble that was around here, replaced the floor so it didn't fall into any holes, broke a bunch of spikes actually to get the wood, but most importantly, this bag just in here. I was talking at the end of the last episode, which by the way, I didn't die yesterday, which I think is worthy of a pat on the back. Been a while since I didn't cark it in one of the videos. Uh, I was looking, looking around, I found this. I was saying yesterday I needed some loot goggles to get over that 100 loot level mark. I'm not actually sure if that's like anything in particular. It does cost me some perception, which I'm going to leave them on for the moment. If I lock those in, whenever I have some decent loot, I assume it doesn't explode in front of me. Whenever I have some decent loot, I can chuck them on and do the looting. Because look, here, loot stage 96, loot stage 101. Definitely a good shout to have those. Now we're there the whole time, just sitting in a bag. Finally coming up for some fresh air that isn't, oh my goodness, that isn't smelling a lot like very decayed bodies. Look at the damage. There's, just, there's damage everywhere. Half the place is falling apart and somehow it didn't fall on my head. But I think this one is not much of a tombstone anymore, but this one I think has the munitions box. I have a little gander at you. I'm going to leave there for the moment and try and scrap you down for any forged steel you might be able to give me. I'm, uh, I'm getting pretty desperate for stuff, so thank you for the one. So I can't really turn down any freebies like that. I'm going to take everything I can find. So what's the plan, Josh? What what are you going to do today? Given that everywhere you go, apparently craters and explosions follow, I don't think I want to raid anywhere that's next to my house. I think I want to move off a little bit further away to try and uh, save off the damage as much as I can. I'll chuck that up there so I can get back in later. Let's go find some sort of building that might give me some decent loot that's not going to trap me in a small room with demos. That's what happened at the chemical place. That's why I got blown to smithereens uh, not too long ago. So if I can avoid getting stuck, I think I'll hopefully survive another day. And that's the dream. We've got a Grumpy's pub here, and I'm a bit partial to going and checking out the pub whenever I come to a new town. Oh, that's a cracker book just there, though. That, I recognize that little footprint anywhere in the world. That's a cracker book. And I've got a nice straight road on the outside as well. That's bloody perfect for me. I'm going to leave you there. I've got two coffees in me at the moment because most of my fluids at the moment is coffee. I did point a, uh, put a skill point into... Oh, get aim. Into... No! No, don't do that. That's not what I wanted. I really didn't want you to set fire to the building because all the books are very flammable. But I put a point into living off the land because I will need some... Oh, there's a lot of demos. I will need some yucca juice a lot of the time. Yeah, okay. That, uh, that has not gone according to plan at all. I thought I'd just run in, draw them out, and shoot them in the street. Well, my frame rate's ass, but apparently they wanted to burn down the building instead and all the books inside. They're keeping all the knowledge to themselves. I gotta get in there. I gotta get in there. Like the Library of Alexandria. I gotta get in there before all the knowledge gets lost. Book. Book's right at the front. Grab you. Nice and quick. Sure. No time to read. Only to pilfer. Oh, there's some books in there that are mildly on fire. I can hear some footsteps outside, though. Yeah, there's another. Oh, you're wasting my time. You have any idea what the stakes are here, Cobber? Sit the fuck down if you don't mind. Take all of that. Oh, I don't think. Oh, more books. Quick, 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 quick. Go. Grab you. There's books just there. They're about to get lost. There was just some paper in it. That was a waste of my time. You're stuck behind a the fence. There's more at the top. There's more at the top, isn't there? Quickly search you. No one hanging out in here. Filing cabinet with some explosive magazines in there. Go fast up. Nothing. Nope. Any fluids for me, though? A tier four wrench. Not too bad. Come on, hurry up. I've grabbed all the things that I can. The building's burning down around me. I need to get... Oh, this is a bad idea. It's a it's actively collapsing while I stand here. You got that? Up to there, please. Oh, this is some risky shit. But through the fire and flames we go. Like a playing freaking guitar hero. T6 armor and some uh, needle and thread. Not too bad. Go faster. Bookstore box. Okay. 
I think the rest of this place is probably... Oh, beyond repair. Drop to that. Drop to them. That's gone up like a goddamn tinderbox. So that's going to call in some screamers. So I'm going to go the bloody goo attack, dude. I need to remember that. So I can't just charge in anymore and lure them out because they will burn the building down that I'm trying to protect. Look at that. Look at it. I was there for half a second and it's smoldering. I'm going to need to find some better built establishments. Like, I mean... <laughs> The fire department's around the corner. I don't think they're going to save the building. You're a two-star into a three-star. Because of the desert rating. I still want to go in and call in all of the... Uh, or call out all the demos, though. I need to do it uh, in a way that isn't going to set fire to things. Turns out all of, like, the loot boxes are... Pretty flammable. Oh, God. There was one on the other side. There was one on the other side. I trusted my ears and my ears might have saved me. Missed it. Better. And while you're down, can I get in nice and quick? Use the spear while you're not oh, shit. No. Oh, God. Oh, I so regret. I so regret giving you the goo attack. It sucks. I hate it. I hate it so much. Why did I do this to myself? I'm trying my best to use the spear so that I can get... Oh, missed it. Ow, it hurt. So I can get that power attack damage when you sat down like that. Yet yeah, you're gone. Stay away from the radiation, though, please. I also just don't want to call in any more attention to myself. No, nope. give it. There's probably a screamer not too far away. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I need to lie down. This it's what it's seven o'clock in the morning, and I'm already stressed out of my freaking mind. Oh man. Yeah, I have I have lots of regrets, but too late now. I've turned up the game. I can't turn it down again. Just have to deal with the consequences of my own muppetry. I broke all my lockpicks on this car, so I'm just gonna have to do it. Just gonna have to do it. Turn off the alarm straight away though and try and get out of here. Please don't touch my mini bike, everyone. I need that. <gasps> For later, that was I think I actually got hit. They got hit a little bit. A little bit of running, a little bit of panicking, a little bit of getting the fuck out of here. No, oh, a little bit of reloading as well. Thank God it's not actually a mission so I can leave as far as I want to. Which actually, it should be... Oh, don't do it. Don't do it. Not unless you're absolutely confident hitting his head. That should be how, like, all of the missions are. Doesn't matter how far you go, as long as you come back and do the mission eventually. He's still not dead. That's a good couple of them. I'm just running straight down the road. Nice straight lines, though, which means nice straight bullets. And nice straight kills. I get a strafe in between them. Oh, just keep an eye on your stamina, Josh. Keep an eye on your stamina. If you've been your stamina, it's all over anyway. Sit you down. Run on pass. It's like, this is the worst conga line ever. All lined up. And one of those times I actually kind of wish I did have the AP ammo. Especially when they're lined up like that, though. Like, no one's at nipple high, so... I don't have to worry too much. Oh, I'm backed up against a fire engine. Hang on. Don't have to worry too much against accidentally popping a demo in the background. Speaking of the background, though, I can't talk today. I'm too, too all over the place. I'm too having a bad time to think of what words I need to say. You're still not dead. Now you are, though. Bit of a carpet of demos, but we're fine. <sighs> read you, read you, read all of those ones from the bookstore place. Read that one as well. I can make myself some dynamite now. Oh, and a robo sledge. Nah, same with this sledge. You has too much of a pension for titties and slapping them around all over the place. He can't be trusted. If I can't be trusted, he can't be trusted. What's in the cop car go? Do I get anything worthwhile out of doing all of that hard work? Pretty please. You gave me a frothy and some ammo. You know what? Not too bad. Just gonna grab that bookcase right there before it mysteriously burns down in front of me. I'm actually pretty chockers on loot. Oh, I got that new wrench too, didn't I? I'll read you. Uh, hang on a second. Modify that one. Take you out of there. You're gonna have just one extra mod slot, but that's A-OK -okay with me. What are you currently rolling with? No, that's fine. You can trade that for that one and that one, and the rest of you can go straight into them. I don't really need you though. You can go in. Like just a little like, random garbage like that I can get rid of. How am I doing though? I'm pretty thirsty. Froths don't quench my thirst, which I have on good authority. My own authority is absolute bloody horse shit. Get rid of you. I need to wait actually. I need to clear the joint, chuck on the loot gogs and then do the looting. Come on, Josh, have some self-control. For once in your life, have control. I'm just luring them out to try and get 
That guy's on fire down there to try and get up into the place as quickly and easily as possible. A little bit battered. Just don't touch. Don't touch the no-no button. It's never been more no-no than it is right now. I think... No, you weren't the one that took all the damage. Neither were you. Stay away from the bike. Stay away. Thank you. Lovely. That's a good amount of damage on all of you guys. Reload again. It's just like it's just like little spot battles. You know, run in, draw their attention, and bring them out to the street for carving. That's bloody gorgeous. That is beautiful. That's why I can't change my goggles over, though, because I'll lose a lot of the potential damage that I'm doing uh, because my perception skill will go lower. Take all of that. I'll read you. I will scrap you. I've got a good amount of ammo. I'm not sure where the rest of it's gone. I think it's all in the bike. But you're just way too close for comfort. You're way too close for comfort. Come over here. Out of the way. Oh. That's why that guy was on fire. All right. Fair enough, then. Oh, my God. Oh, you cheeky little git. I heard the... <laughs> Did you set yourself on fire there, you absolute larrikin? I heard the sound of the door opening behind me and shat myself. Just like he kind of did. If I before... Oh, stay out of the goop. Lovely. Save yourself the ammo. Save yourself the noise. Beautiful. Take both of those. Oh, man. You snuck up behind me. This place is a death trap. I need to call out the rest of the demos in here. There's a flaming pipe. I've... Listen, I've... I've... No! Oh, I thought the fire was out. As long as you don't spread, I'll hopefully be okay. Can I, like, can I help? Can I put out the fire by breaking the things that are burning? As long as you don't spread, I'll be okay, I think, I hope. I'm just gonna break you. Yep, that hurts. That hurts. That hurts a lot. That hurts a lot. I don't have anything to put that out again. Ah, clever. See, I'd got, I'd, I've done that before with, like, shotguns. You can break the pipe with the shotgun because shotgun kills buildings, and that's all well and good, but apparently they've thought ahead to Muppets like me and decided that, you know what? Nah, you can't break down the pipe. Well done, fun pimps. I can't, I can't begrudge you for seeing ahead and seeing what I was up to. I'm going to chuck in that immediately. I'll keep... Actually, I'll keep you on me so I can make some extra uh, first aid bandos in a moment because I'm going to need two of those to get my health back. Yeah, right. Fair enough. <laughs> I should have seen that coming. I think this whole ground floor is empty, which is even more annoying because the valve for that fire post was just there. Could have saved myself a lot of heartache by doing it that way around, but even so, chuck on the looting gogs and get looting. I think I need some more... Ooh, I need some more to make bandages, but the first aid bandos. Yeah, nah, fair enough then. I need, what, another 12 of them? It's rare to need more cloth fragments. A f you can just find those? I didn't know you could just find those. Fireman's Axe mod. 25% more damage to blocks and 25% less damage to enemies. That's fine. I never put it against enemies anyway. You can go in like that. Bloody beautiful. You can go into that one. All right. I've never had one of those before. I never bothered to make it, but a freebie, absolutely. There's a doggo just having a little snooze underneath his little shelter. Hang on a second. Anywhere will do on you, because... Oh. Because what I was thinking... Oh, good God. It feels good when you get that instant decap. I was thinking that with my new super duper jumpy boys, I'm a quite... Not quite hoppy enough to get up onto the, the balcony up there and get up a different way. I'm just so nervous about burning down the building. I really am. Oh, I did that without my perception goggles on as well. All right, well, same thing there. Let's draw all the zombies out, lure them out the front, try not to burn out all the loot. Hello? Hello? Not hello? Oh, yep, goodbye. All right, cool. We're gone. They, they oozed. Why did you ooze? I wasn't even close to you, dude. Oh, that's all the loot that's got to be gone now. There's burning demos coming through the bloody windows. Sit you down. Don't even try. Don't even try, Josh. You, you can't save the building. You probably can't even save the loot up there now. Oh, that's so costly. I thought I did that so well. I didn't give him a chance to come and find him. And they still started vomiting everywhere. I've got to try. Oh, maybe I shouldn't try. I was going to say, I've got to try to at least get up there and see if the loot's even gettable at all. Oh! 
Oh my god. Okay, the loot's still here. The loot's still here. Go faster, go faster. Just, I mean, I've got the fireman's axe mods. I should be able to get here nice and quickly. Come on. Working stiffs. Oh, wait, 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 wait on a second. Proper gogs. Oh, the fire's spreading. Just take, just take and go. Not even looking, not even reading, not even anything. Grab you. I did see a pile of books. Thank you. And a red bag. Oh, God. Oh, ow. Oh, yep, I was expected. I was expected. A little bit on fire. A little bit burny. Uh, you. Put the flames out, please. The power of fear compels you. Nice, Gary. I'm a little bit cucumber, but I got what I needed. Look how fast the fire spreads. Look how fast it spreads. I'm burning down the fire department. The irony's not lost on me. There's a lot of things breaking in there. So while I'm... Oh, that's a screamer. That's a screamer. Damn it. Damn it. I just go. Just go. Just go. What are you even trying for? Just because it's a screamer doesn't mean it's any weaker. It will still have all the hit points of a demo and will still call in a horde. So just, uh, just numb. Fall back a little bit and... Ooh. Grab a loot bag that you apparently left behind from before. Take all of that. I'm a little bit cucumber. I have to read what I got out of that loot bag. Okay. I mean, it looks cool. I love... I wish this was more, this was more a thing in vanilla. Like, the Spreadable Fire mod, obviously, I think should be in vanilla anyway. It'd make Molotovs way less OP. But imagine, like, just, like, occasionally, incidentally, there was a chance for any POI to randomly burst into flames. Maybe not ones that have a land claim block so it doesn't burn down your house, but... Imagine just going down the street and finding a bit like that. Just uh, currently ablaze from a gas leak or something. That'd be sick. Scrap you. Scrap you. Scrap you. Automatic weapons. Drum magazines. Not the last book. Read you. Read you. Read all of you. I can make iron tools quality four. So better than we're currently rolling. Got some extra fluids as well, which I'm very thankful for. Because I'm not only burning to death half the time, but heck and bloody thirsty. Nice. Okay, we also got a speaker out of there somewhere. That's, um, that's gone pretty well. I'm going to need some yucca. I was going to change it over for that one for fast harvesting. Might be time for me to quickly run back to my little crypt and put all that shit away and get some yucca on the craft. I won't lie, I'm definitely unsure about the feasibility of having the demos having that vomiting attack. Uh, it's burning, like every building I go to now, it's burning down. And it's not because, like, I'm doing anything wrong so much. It's just, like, their, their default attack now. I can't go that way. There's a screamer now. I'll go the long way around. Yeah, it's just, like, their default action. So even if I'm not kind of close to them, they'll start burning places down. Which means, obviously, I'm fighting against fire to try and get the loot and stuff. But I feel like that should only really happen if I fuck up. Not just because I'm anywhere nearby. So I'm, like... I'm unsure. I'm unsure about whether that's a, a thing I want to keep or not. We tried it. We're working with it, but it's almost too much. Oh, look at it. <laughs> that's all that's left of the cracker book. It's all gone. If I take it a second, I'm a little bit cucumbered at the moment. I'm gonna chuck you guys away if I can. It's all gone. It's all completely gone. This is what I mean, though. Th this is what I'm like. I was just running through. That demo vaulted before it even bloody saw me. It's too much. It's, I, I can't have the entire world turning into this. I'll never find any loot ever again. It's too bloody much. Thanks to the demos of old, there's a perfect spot right underneath you to chuck in another land claim block. That's my third. Jeez, I came a long way out here, didn't I? I just want to quickly make sure. Look, the land clay block from the first place I lived is still there. So that's all nice and fine. That one's not going to get taken away anytime soon. Then, although I just noticed that's still where my bedroll is. Bedroll. I've made that mistake before and spawned in the middle of nowhere this time around. Uh, yep, yeah, sure. Right about there will do. Beautiful. Thank you. If I die, I mean, if I die, it's all over anyway. So that's kind of redundant, but okay. Yep, sure. <laughs> it's fine. So the first time in ages, I finally think to place a new bed roll down, but it doesn't even matter. Oh, my son, I get super thirsty, but that's why I specifically went out, put my point into uh, living off the land to get all the yucca that I needed. Get your cooking away. I don't have any murky waters. That might start being a problem before too long. Make some bacon and eggs as well. Yeah, that's no, sure. Why not? You need about five minutes of fuel. There you go. That's way too many. <laughs> that's a little bit better. Beautiful. Okay. So, what's the time? It's half past three. 
I do have a little bit of fluids left over in you, but not an awful lot. The dog foods do nothing for no one, so I'll just eat you. You're taking up space. I need to start actually organizing this so that I can go to the trader. Mm -hmm. I might go this afternoon and do a quick little, like, T1 job for him. Um, you can go over there. That can be my sellables box. Cheeky little T1. Get some cred. Get some love. Get some more money. And get ready to sell some stuff later on. I was going to sell these T6 iron gloves, but oh, I've also got you. And you. Potentially... Oh, potentially. Look, I'm worried about explosive damage, right? And I'm currently rolling light armor. There, there. I could go full heavy. I could go full heavy all across the board. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it purely because, at least according to the comments, <laughs> which I trust at my own risk, I know, um, heavy armor protects against explosives better than light armor does. Plus, I've got some extra mod slots in all of you. Do you have any other mods I can chuck into this stuff, actually? Anything around... You guys aren't armor mods. You also don't have any mods, but that's okay. Hopefully, that will keep me a little bit safer. Oh, I need to chuck you guys in as well. Almost missed you guys. Hang on a second. Go like that. Hopefully, that will keep me safer. I'm not getting any chooks at all, but... I mean, it stands to reason. Like, you know, surely, right? I'm going to be noisier, less stealthy, but <laughs> I'm already up a tree on that one anyway. I hadn't put any points into light armor yet, which is good. Specialized light armor, increase the armor rating. So you would have given me a little bit more, but I can then put my uh, my point into heavy armor instead. Reduce heavy armor movement penalty by 5% and increases durability by 50. I usually go light. I usually go light. So we're going to try something dis different this time around. Put some of that into me. That gives me 34 hydration instead of like the 20 from a coffee. Two of those should get me right as rain again. Nice. Let's get out there. We'll see if Trady actually wants to sell me any fluids. I mean, speaking of fluids, there's a lot coming out of the sky. I, this I mean, look, you've got dew collectors now. I understand that being a thing, but there should be rain collectors as well. Just like a barrel, just like in Darkness Falls. So when it's pissing down like this, you get some water. that it increase, like, the challenge of living in the desert too. Which, you know, it has an extra element to it. It's not just the same as living everywhere else. It should be proper rain collectors. I'm gonna do the same thing again, because last time... Last time I was here, it was pretty bad for everyone. Actually, that's a good point. I exploded someone just outside this gate and assumed it was just a crater. But there's trader protections. I mean, I mean, I, I would have been tough to ride the bike out of here, but I probably could have managed it. Alright, fair enough then. I was gonna say, like, surely it hasn't undermined the trader potato, but we're all good. Alright. Knackers, how are you? Do you have any fluids in you? You got ooh, some mega crushes. I'm partial to a cheeky mega crush or eight. Very expensive though. I have those back at home. Shit. Talk to you. Got any water? You've got four cheeky waters for 400 smackers. Or I could just back myself a water collector. That's the thing. I could make that dew collector and it's no less effective in the desert as it is in the pine forest. That seems dumb. That seems silly to me when I come back another time and I buy one of those. Nerve, but for now, wrong one. I will take... Fetch, clear zombies. Probably the clear zombies. So I might burn down the building. And I burn down the building, I can't get the satchel. And then I'm shit out of luck. There's another demo at the gates. And I kind of just want to go... Not like that. Hold on. Like that. I'm far enough away to be safe, but... <laughs> there goes the rest of the billboard. Like, oh, can I... Could I use that to my advantage? I want to see how, like, how deep it's going to go. Because you're just going to keep... Oh, my God. You're just going to keep tunneling into the earth. Anyone else out here? Anyone at all? I, this is like a little, like, POI. There's a little food stash here, but... There's a demo who spawned in. Hang on a second. Read you. I'm going to eat your fish and enjoy it. All right. Come over here. I'm going to run back super bravely back inside the crater compound. And, oh, and then he's disappeared. All right, never mind then. But someone else is mad about it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Another one. Sit up on the porch and take my shot. So much easier to hit nipples now with the eight times scope. More fight. That poor bloody billboard, dude. That billboard's copped an absolute pounding. How deep is it now? I'm just <laughs> excavating the site. Yeah, look at that. It's getting worse and worse down there. Oh my God, it's deep over there too. Look at the range of the explosion as well. Is it just this place? It is. Oh, it's a fast food joint. The fast food joint's made out of stone, so... Oh, get fucked. So it's not going to burn down around me this time. At least I bloody hope not. Oh, it's, it's 6 o'clock, though. In fact, hang on a second. 
Once my loot stage, is there any point in me changing over my goggles? 92. Not really, but we'll see. Did I get another skill point there, actually? I didn't. All right. Tickle you. Ready or not, here I come. It's going oh, to be pretty close. Oh, my God. Oh, I actually jumped. I actually fucking jumped. You jump scared me. You bloody prick. Whew. Okay. That's all right, though. Now that I've got my wits back around me, I can finish you. I don't think there's going to be an easy way for me to get in and out of this place, but I'll pop the door and lure them out the front. Oh, there's another one waiting for me, too. Hang on. Terrible first pill. Absolute dog water first pill. They're right in front of you still, Shankton. The hell are you doing, Woodle? We're okay, though. We're okay. I don't think I killed you. They, that's like instantaneous, the pop on that goo. Gone. Oh, I was going to say there was another one. Oh, my stamina. My stamina. My stamina. Oh, that was a dicey move. Oh, it was a fucking dicey move. Aiming down the scope has cooked me stamina, and I bloody hate that for me. Yeah, oh, there's, there's a few more coming. There's a few more coming. Did I bring any fluids with me? I don't think that I did. I don't really want to go with the AK. I also should be aiming on the sights with you because there's no bloody point doing that. Oh, reload faster. Come on. Come on, stamina. Other side of the wall. I did see one of them break through the wall down here, so there should be a window for me to get through. Gone. Or well, not gone, but sat. And then sit you as well. Oh, you cheeky fuck. Stamina. Stamina. Get around. Get around. Get around the back of the building instead. Holy shit, this sucks. I hopped to the wall. The power of parkour might save my life on that one. I got a little bit of time to get my stamina back again. Oh, I do. I bought the water from Trady so I can get you in, get my stamina regen going. This is definitely turned into much more of a fight than I was really ready for. Two gone. I hear footsteps to my right. Hold on. Yeah, there was another one. I had to just get quickly get the reload going, though. It's 7 p.m. You're gone. Another one, though. Straight towards me, please. Straight towards me, please. Beautiful. And while you're down, stab. Stab and gone. Even though that cooks my... Oh, but look. Killing with the stamina. Killing with the spear gives me the stamina back. That's the play. That's the play. That's why getting all those bloody books was such a good idea. Gone. Stamina boosted. Oh, that sucked. It's so bleeding hot today. It's 40 degrees in the shade. Can I get up? Up you go. That's the way I'm supposed to go through there. It is still a clear a clear quest. I thought I thought you were still I thought you were still getting up. And you set fire to the bloody building, because of course you did. Oh, it was close to his nip. Oh, it was mighty close to his nip. Get up on their level. Straight towards me. He's dead. He's dead soon. I, I mean, the building's made out of stone, but it doesn't mean that the rest of it can't burn down, though. Nothing else there. Okay, yeah, it's extinguished itself. The front door is open. Unlock you. Run on through. Wake everybody up who might be here. This is why I wanted to pop the door to start with. Looks nice and safe. I was going to say, there's usually a crawler in that back room, so I'm sure there's going to be a demo. Just wait for him here. Just wait for him here. Tickle no nips and we'll be okay. There you are. Wait for the wiggly waggly noggin to come back into my scope again. Stand up. Got the one in the background by accident. Let my stamina come back because scoping is fucking exhausting. I'm going to go with this. Stab. Good. Full stamina again. And then murder you. That was fucking clean. It's given me the mark of where the last demo is. And apparently it's not inside. It was just the pigeroo. Fuck yeah. Done. Chuck you on. I'm going to scrap you and you and start raiding everything. It's late on the day. I could try and go back to tradies, but I'd rather get the loot. T6 spear. Scrap you. In fact, I don't need you either, nor you. Or oh, that's a waste of everybody's time and pocket space. Oh, okay. <sighs> Night time's about to fall, but I'm still alive. Just get through the day, Josh. Just get through the day. Count no chooks. Feels like a million years ago that I uh, built a base in this building. In fact, I think it was the first series of Alpha 21. I used this little, like, notch in the roof. It was like horde every night, I think it was. Yeah, it was. Use that notch in the roof to build myself a horde base. Came in through there and I defended down there. 
Jeez, that was a that was a long bloody time ago now. Free coffee, free fluids. Thank you. You can piss off. Search the modern oven for nothing too. I really just want water. I searched all the loos. I searched all the um the drink dispensers. I got three waters out of it. That's not much, but I'm definitely not complaining. The main loot at the end is a Shamway box. Probably should have been expected. Still can't quite two tap the boxes. I'll read you. You give me five water as well, so you're always a good slurp. All right, let's get this stuff and go. I might still make it back to tradies in the end. You can get scrapped. Search the desk. You can get scrapped. Search you. You can get scrapped. For goodness sake. Cancel both of you and scrap you all together. That's a good mod to get though for my new heavy armor. You can go straight into that one. Beautiful. Nothing else around. Filing cabinets. What are we now? 44 out of 75. Still a long bloody way to go. All right, speaking of going, time for me to go. Let's get out, get back to tradie, search for cash. No, I've come in the other way. It's risky leaving my mini bike in here because I might get kicked out and lose it inside. I've already checked you, nothing. Already checked you, nothing. All right, Wreckers. I don't have any X XP gogs on me, but that's okay. But I'm all over the shop today. Another improved fittings mod or some pipe bombs. I will take you. Thank you very much. Another tip. Is that where I live? Next time, no, it's the other one. It's the other one. It's made out of stone. I might be able to do that tomorrow for you there, champion. But I'm going to leave real quick and get back home before nighttime falls. You can go like that. I think the nighttime will auto close. Ow, the doors. Cheers, mate. Love that for you. Enjoy your nap. I'll enjoy mine. As long as I make it home in time. I've made it home in time. The night time has just fallen. I'm just grabbing some of the plants that are in my yard. Turn off your headlight, please, Josh, because it's very bloody loud. Sean, I mean, you make riddle me that one. Apparently, light is loud these days, but take all of you. I'm going to sneak my way down into the depths of my little home. <laughs> I can't believe that place burned down so readily. It was, like, it was made out of matchboxes, basically. Went up like bloody petrol. I've got my fire cooking. Got a good amount of yucca on the way as well. In fact, there's going to be an extra one as soon as you're done. Yucca. You, you. Nice. That's not quite enough time. So I'll chuck in an extra one of you. Nice, Gary. Okay. So things are... Ooh, gee whiz. I can jump a long way while I'm crouching. Do I have that book that means perk books, urban combats... Mm, is it not urban combat? I thought there's a book that means I can jump just as high. Oh, that's, that'd be a good book to get too. I'm just going to say urban combat would be a very good book to get. Plus, obviously, urban combat 5. Where is it then? Where's the book that means I can jump the same height when I'm crouched as otherwise? I could have sworn it was urban combat. I... Night Stalker? No, I, I have no idea. No idea. No idea, but it doesn't super duper matter to me. I'm going to spend the night clearing out the rest of this rubble and garbage around here just to make it feel a little bit nicer. Like, it's not great already. I'm, <laughs> it doesn't feel like home at all because it's barely a cave, but it keeps the demos away from it, which, come to think of it, I should be standing over here in this little spot of darkness where I'm as far away from the outer walls as muppetly possible. Oh, two days in a row now I've survived. Look at me go. <laughs> good, good job me finally keeping my limbs attached to my body. After the days that led up to this, 15 and 16, I'm just stoked to still be breathing. Well, that means what? I've got, I've got what, 19? It's day 19 and day 20. I should, I'll spend day 19 here, getting whatever else I can, and then, and then I gotta go. I might even spend the night... I like the morning of day 20, riding all the way back. So I've got day 20 and then day 21 to prepare for the next horde night. Loot's great. It's not worth dying over. i got to get back and i got to get this ruinous area ready for the next horde. It's going to be so bloody bad. It's going to be so bloody bad. I'll have to come back and try and survive how bad it's going to be for another day in the next episode. Because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the pages of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you liked it, make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If we're going to talk to you there first. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.